Okay. Dad, your hand is jammed in the toaster. What's that? Yeah! Shouldn't be too hard to fix with the right tools. <coughs> there, better than new. Now to take her for a test toast. And what the? <coughs> Look at that. I'm the first non-Brazilian person to travel backwards through time. Correction, Homer. You're the second. That's right, Mr. Peabody. Quiet, you. <gasps> I've gone back to the time when dinosaurs weren't just confined to zoos. <laughs> okay, don't panic. Remember the advice your father gave you on your wedding day. If you ever travel back in time, don't step on anything, because even the tiniest change can alter the future in ways you can't imagine. Fine. As long as I stand perfectly still and don't touch anything, I won't destroy the future. Stupid bug! You go squish now! <gasps> but that was just one little insignificant mosquito. That can't change the future, right? Right? I'm back. Oh, my loving family. Nothing's changed. Kindly <laughs> host, Laverinos. Oakley, Oakley. Hey, what the hell is that geek Flanders doing on TV? Oh, I see by the big board we got a negative Nelly in Sector 2. I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask the whole family to kind of freeze and prepare for re-education. Don't you remember, Dad? Flanders is the unquestioned lord and master of the world. Don't! <laughs> okay, everybody, let's see some big smiles. Just relax and let the hooks do their work. What the hell are you smiling at? Oh. Now, in case all that smiling didn't cheer you up, there's one thing that never fails. A nice glass of warm milk, a little nap, and a total frontal lobotomy. It's not so bad, Homer. They go into your nose and they let you keep the piece of brain they cut out. Look. Ooh, hello. Hello there. Who's that big man there? Who's that? Join us, Father. It's bliss. No! They're gaining on me. Wait, I have an idea. These wieners will give me the quick energy I need to escape. Oh. 